recognize the member for Fredericton West Hanwell. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Well, it's a pleasure to rise in the House today to, uh, to welcome three guests from the Duke of Edinburgh's uh, award scheme, and I'd ask them to stand and be recognized. We're joined today by Danielle McLeod, who's the Executive Director, uh, Keith Barr, who's the Vice President of the Board, and Dean Mundy, who's a Director of the Board. And we welcome them here to the Legislature today. Mr. Speaker, as you probably know, the Duke of Edinburgh's program is aimed at young Canadians aged from 14 to 24, and we're, we're joined as well by a number of young Canadians who should consider the award scheme because it includes physical fitness, skills, community service, adventurous journey, and residential projects. And all of these challenges are designed to encourage youth to become better involved in themselves and better involved in their community. There are three, standard, three standards of the award, gold, silver, and bronze. And indeed, our own Clara Smith, a page here in the legislature, was recently awarded her gold award in Halifax by His Royal Highness Prince Edward, the Duke of es Earl of Wessex, I should say. So it's a great scheme. It's a great uh, award program. And it's because of the dedication, of, uh, hard, dedication and hard work of volunteers like those that have joined us here today that this uh, is available to New Brunswickers. So I'd ask all members to join me in welcoming these representatives.